हेलो स्टूडेंट्स समग्र शिक्षा सिद्धिपेट प्रेजेंट्स आवर वर्ल्ड थ्रू इंग्लिश क्लास सिक्स पेज थर्टी वन यूनिट थ्री व्हाट कैन अ डॉलर एंड इलेवन सेंट्स डू पेज थर्टी टू ए रीडिंग An eight-year-old child Tess heard her parents talking about her little brother Andrew. All she knew was that Andrew was very sick and her parents did not have enough money for the treatment. They were moving into a smaller house because they could not afford to stay in the present house after paying the doctor's bills. He needed a costly surgery now and there was no one to loan them the money so her parents lost their hope and gave up their efforts when tess heard her daddy say to her tearful mother only a miracle can save him now she went to her room and pulled a jar of coins from a cupboard she poured all the money out on the floor and counted it carefully holding the jar tightly she made her way to the medical store and placed it on the glass table what do you want asked the chemist it's for my little brother tess answered he is really really sick and i want to buy a miracle we don't sell miracles here child i'm sorry the chemist said smiling sadly at the little girl listen i have the money to pay for it if it isn't enough i can try and get some more just tell me how much it costs page 33 at the shop there was a well dressed customer he bent down and asked the little girl what kind of miracle does your brother need I don't know she replied with her eyes welling up he's really sick and mummy says he need an operation but my dad cannot pay for it so i have brought my savings how much do you have asked the man 1 dollar and 11 cents but i can try and get some more she answered barely audible wonderful smiled the man a dollar and 11 cents the exact price of a miracle 
for your little brother. He took her money in one hand and held her hand with the other. He said, Take me to your home. I want to see your brother and meet your parents. Let's see if I have the kind of miracle he needs. That well-dressed man was Dr. Carlton Armstrong, a famous neurosurgeon. He had Andrew admitted to hospital where he operated on him without any charges. Within a few weeks, Andrew was back at home and doing well. That surgery, her mum whispered, was a miracle. I wonder how much it would have cost. Tess smiled. She knew exactly how much the miracle cost. One dollar and eleven cents plus the love of a little child.